skywalking. Amen. Psalm 33, verse 18 and 19. This covenant has no respect for circumstances and situations. Behold, the eye of the Lord is upon them that fear him, upon them that hope in his mercy. What will he do for them? To deliver their soul from death and keep them alive in famine. Our churches are in the hinterland of the northern north. How dare you, Pakatano? The lion sits there. His name is Jesus, the lion of the tribe of Judah. You can be in the midst of trouble and not know it. When you walk in the light of God's word, you do what God, God's word says. You're just alive. In the region of death, you are just awake. Come on now. Yes. Psalm 37 and verse 18 and 19. I'd like you to just know that your case is different. Yes. The Lord knew the days of the upright who are doing it right, doing according to the dictates of scriptures, and their inheritance shall be what? Yes. Now, they shall not be ashamed in the evil time. In the days of famine, they shall be satisfied. That you will serve a covenant keeping God. What he's saying now is that praise me and watch me show up in your matter. Praise me and watch my fresh oil come upon your life and change your story. Are you ready? Lift up those two hands and thank him for making your case different by redemption. Thank him for making your case, the case of your family different because of redemption. Celebrate him and magnify him in Jesus' precious name.